I cannot team. believe Shaq was not drafted. I mean, come on, it's well, Hakeem is better. That Hakeem was better, idiotic. Yeah. Not at, not no, in Shaq's huh? prime. Hakeem is better. Shaq at his best. Hakeem at his Shaq best is better. better. No, okay, whatever. Hakeem at his best is better. Why? He's the best two way player ever. <laughs> like, like in NBA history. Ever? Yeah, no, ever. You're lying now. Who's better? Two way? Probably LeBron James. What? <laughs> two way play? <laughs> LeBron defense? James defense. LeBron, yes, LeBron is not a better defender than Akeem at LeBron all. LeBron James should have a DPOI. But Let's LeBron's just keep an elite it a defense. Akeem has one. Yeah, ag agreed, but LeBron, LeBron James got should robbed. be. LeBron yeah, he got, got absolutely Joel, robbed. Just Marcus just almost second Joel, team in one DPOI. Joel, Joel, he, all right, put what? the team part aside. No, no, yeah, who's no, a better you defender? Cannot, Hakeem who's or a LeBron? better player overall, LeBron or Hakeem? It's LeBron. Oh, I didn't say it's LeBron. No, you you asked the question. Yeah, I said two you way. said best two way ability. Who's the better defender? Hakeem Olajuwon. By far, who's the best offensive player, arguably of all time? LeBron James. You pair the best two -way defender player. ever. It's Hakeem Olajuwon. Is it signed and sealed? Wait, so he's hold on, hold on, hold on. He's a walking ever? twenty-eight, I, I like twelve, Dennis and Rodman. four blocks. They don't, they don't, they don't watch the team. Dennis Rodman, best defender ever. That's the cap. I don't understand this because LeBron James is, is he is he or is he not classified a two way player? For no, sure, he's classified as all around. Player. Okay, is no, he, he classified is, as no, a two way? All player? around is all two way. Is he no, a two way really. player? So he, wait, what? LeBron's not a two way player. I, LeBron's I think all not around, an elite defender. And all around, that. all around is a better a better way to describe LeBron than two way. Yeah, yeah, two way really makes me think you're like a bucket offensively and you could go. All right, but we're. Let's like not LeBron get pigeonholed. No, 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 best play maker. You're complimenting him. Got it. No, no, I got you. What is Kawhi? What is Kawhi? He's a two-way player. He's a yes. two-way player. You. You, there is yes. a distinct yes. difference Agreed. between a two-way player and LeBron. I understand. LeBron is a two-way player. No, no LeBron no, has no. always been okay. known as an all-around all player. All-around's better. He's a, bro, all around's better. Yes, he's saying, of yes, course all-around's better, but that doesn't mean LeBron's not a two-way player. He is a two-way player. No, was Hakeem that. not an all-around player? Who? Hakeem was. Okay, but, but he's not a two-way player. Ha yes, Hakeem is the best yeah, two-way player in, in the world. I, know. I, think I don't getting, understand what you were I saying, though. If LeBron up. is a two-way player and he's a better player than ha than Hakeem, he's a he's better, better two-way two -way player, player anyway. That's the stupidest shit I've <laughs> ever heard in my life. How? LeBron is a no, better... You're, no, you're sounding loud and no, dumb no, and no. wrong. LeBron is a all-around player. He's always been known as that. But when you talk just two-way, you are talking score the ball... Play defense in terms of two way LeBron ability. James in terms of two that? way ability, Hakeem Olajuwon is up there. Yes, no, he's the best he is. in the no, world. I'm saying that he's, he's not the best in the so world. Is LeBron. So is LeBron. LeBron James. Is LeBron a better two way than Kawhi at his best? No. Yes. Yes. Oh. He what? Is. It's LeBron James. It's what LeBron are we talking James. about? James. Yes. What? Yes. I'm fine with this. Riff. Riff. I'm fine with this. Riff. Yes. He Kawhi is. as a two way, he was better. Yes. LeBron got robbed by a Stop guy that wasn't the first I don't team care. defense. Wait, listen, we're talking about I'm, defense. We don't care Marcus about those awards. We don't care about those awards. We don't really care about those awards. All right, we so don't. then he can guard one through five. Can he can guard one through five? Yes. One through five. Oh, shit. He can guard Steph Curry. Hakeem is 7-1. He can guard Steph Curry. He can go out there and guard Hakeem can guard Steph Curry. How the fuck are we supposed to know that? He didn't play the LeBron James can guard Steph Curry. He can also guard Dwight Howard. Dwight has no offensive game. I'm so talking about a big man. He can bang down low with a big bang, man. He, he can, can also no, go on no, the perimeter no, and you're, fucking no, guard. You're over exaggerating. He, no, he cannot no, guard. Not doing that. He cannot I'm guard center to actually have post game. Can he guard Akeem? No, you know Probably he can't. Not. I know. Can he guard David Robinson? No. Tim Duncan? No. Yes. No. Yes, no. He can. he can guard Tim Duncan. Yes, he can. Yes, he can. Why? Because he's stronger than him. The Tim Duncan? Yeah, he's LeBron James is one of the strongest in the game ever. LeBron James is Jimmy, one of the strongest player him? ever. Yes. What yes, the, he is. What? That doesn't even make sense. Well, I think it's a bit unfair to say. How? If you're trying to bang with LeBron James, you're not going to get any strong. leverage. Because he's, he's stronger. It's why was Dwight, Dwight the most dominant, dominant ever? Because he was stronger than no, everyone that's else. That's not why Dwight was yeah, No. What? I, you're I lying. Said no, you said Dwight. I mean, you, you said Dwight. Dwight. You said Dwight. Why was Shaquille O'Neal the best, most dominant player ever? Because he was stronger than everybody else. If you are stronger, yes, you have more leverage. LeBron James is stronger than Tim Duncan. Just because you're stronger doesn't mean you can guard somebody. That is a big reason why LeBron James is able to guard one through five because of his size and his strength. Well, I think it's unfair to ask LeBron to guard these all-time centers. I agree. He can't shut them down. But that's also he my can't, it's not fair to ask Hakeem to guard He started with saying Hakeem exactly. can't guard exactly. My but whole point is we've seen LeBron do the, the I think, guarding. I think it's just because he's more of a wing defender. This is the thing, though. Hakeem, defensively, I think is better than LeBron, but LeBron offensively is way better it's than It's not Hakeem. even a competition. Uh, yeah, it's the playmaking. Okay. But in terms and, of and two-way go get in the bucket and, and I scoring. think the gap then, between LeBron on offense ooh. over out, overweighs Is LeBron a top five defender Hakeem's ever? defense. Is LeBron a top five defender ever? 
No, he's not a top five defender ever. So he's the doing? best offensive player but in, the, probably in, not in the top five offensive player ever. Ooh, Hakeem's probably not top five offensive player ever. Can I ask, why isn't LeBron in these all-time defensive conversations? Because there's a bunch of defensive players that are better than I him, also think okay. everything but else he does, does overshadows it. what does LeBron not do on an elite level on defensive LeBron's side of the ball? LeBron's defense gets overshadowed because I vividly remember when he was in his prime in Miami, he took the primary of assignment on Derrick, Derrick Rose, Rose and locked him up. Locked him up. Yes. He locked him up in but the But that's playoffs. my whole point. I look at LeBron and understand, yes, you are an all-time elite offensive player, but that does not allow me to forget what you do on the defensive side. The, the versatility, the ability to switch onto versatile. anything. My Kevin Garnett, just as versatile. He's 6'11", can guard the rim, too, with the best of them. Garnett, I'm here. I'm with versatile, you. Versatile. Can guard the rim, Agreed. too. With the best LeBron of them. LeBron can you, guard you, the no, rim, too. Not, no. See, and this not is what, of their level, this is, of but course this is why, not. This is why you're, you're, not, you're not understanding the conversation. When you're talking about all-time defensive players, the reason why these big men like Tim Duncan, like Hakeem, like Kevin Garnett, get put in those conversations because not only are they versatile, even Bam out of bio, like not only are they versatile as fuck, mm -hmm. but they can guard the rim, which is one of the most important pieces of a defense. Can you guard the rim? Can you watch out for four other of your players and have their backs? Those guys are the best at that. So when you're talking just strictly you have, to, he cannot no, do that for a game or a whole no. season. He can't. But this he just conversation, can't. Like, see that in not moments even, but that's not even a knock. No, because at moments, but that's not even a knock of LeBron. He's a wing. You're not supposed to be able to do that. But, but when you but the responsibility, it's it's, it's just a responsibility. I understand thing. that point. They are big men. They're supposed yes, to do that. Yes. As a wing, you're supposed to be able to guard the perimeter, be versatile, be able to switch. In terms of switchability, LeBron is one of the best yes. ever. I would never disagree mm -hmm. with that. But in terms of just overall what you can do as a defender, Tim Duncan, Hakeem Olajuwon, Kevin Garnett, just to name a few, mm -hmm. they check every single box as seven footers. Mm -hmm. This That's conversation just was never about who's a better defender, though. It was never it was about, about two way. Yeah. Two way. That's yeah. why I obviously am going to say LeBron. I'm going to keep. That's nuts. But we got, like, we got Shaquille O'Neal. We got Shaquille O'Neal. And picks. we got yeah. LeBron. We, yes. So LeBron was our first pick. Excuse yeah. me. Got Shaq. You guys went Hakeem and TD. Duncan. I thought those were solid picks. Damn. I do think that Shaquille O'Neal should have won. We have That's Shaq. That's how really started. Hakeem yes. versus Shaq. Yeah, we got Allen Iverson on the board still. I still think. Hold yes. on, question, uh -huh. draw a question. Just you, you said LeBron over Hakeem, because all around, right? So who's better, Hakeem or Shaq? All around. And be honest. That shit's not close. Well, same, it's the same argument, is it not? The thing is, Shaq, Shaq was sneaky, a good playmaker. Shaq, the, the, the thing He sneaky this is was. Shaq was so dominant, you have and to Prime take Shaq that was, into account tenfold. Because there are a lot Prime of players. Shaq was blocking there, shots. There are players that you kind of, you would say are more skilled than Giannis. That aren't better than Giannis. He's right. I didn't say skill. When you told me LeBron versus Akeem, you said because he's a better all-around player, that makes him a better two-way player. That's what you said. So I asked you, Hakeem versus Shaq. It's the same argument. Hakeem is a better all-around player. We can all agree at this table. It may not be a lot. It may not be little. But he is a better all-around player. So is it not the same argument back and forth? Or is it just different because it's not LeBron? Wait, hold up. Shaq, Are you though, assuming I, that my I, answer I is wrong? Shaq? I was going to say. Player? No, I'm asking you. Okay. I think Hakeem has more facets to his game. He's a better shooter. I think he has more. He's, he's, he's a better all around player. player. I think he's a better all around player. I think he's a better two way player okay. than Shaq. Yeah, okay. I agree. But I just, LeBron, I just, I just LeBron want... is a better all around player. No, 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 as long as we keep it consistent, yes, yes. I'm fine. Yes. I'm thinking, yeah, I'm thinking. Because you took Shaq's career is better though. Okay. Yes. I don't know. No, it's better. No, it is. He three peated. Okay. And he should have more. He, he did. He did. And, and Michael Jordan's era, even though Michael yeah. Jordan didn't play basketball, he didn't have Kobe. He like yes. he, did not have he didn't Kobe. have Kobe. He didn't have D Wade. Yeah, Clyde Drexler. Clyde Drexler he wasn't was Kobe. Yeah, he's, all right, he, he wasn't, wasn't Kobe, Kobe. But no, they were even Kobe. D -Wade. they were comparing him to Michael, even though they shouldn't that was, have that back was in, in the Portland. day. That wasn't yes. in Houston. But he was still him. He wasn't even D Wade. He wasn't even D Wade. He was great. Team won without an All Star. Well, to say he wasn't even D Wade. D Wade was the best player on that team. Ring without an All Star player. Nobody that year made the Don't gas game. it, though. No, we know what happens. Clyde was, though. Hakeem went MVP, DPOI, finals MVP in the same year. He's amazing. Shaq did that? Never. No, he didn't. Mm, no, no, no. Tough look. But he did Damn. go three in a row. He and he does, have, more he, he does cool. have the three-peat MVPs and stuff. And he has scoring title, if I'm not mistaken, too. I, think I mean, does. Shaq was the most dominant feet. force in the league for sure. a, they played, a long though. time. Don't ever forget that. Yeah, yeah. When Shaq was a puppy in the league. Hakeem was 36. It's okay. It's okay. Shaq was a puppy in the league. Shaq walked in different. So what, I don't what, even care about the What were the part. Orlando Magic before Shaq got there? He led them to the finals what was very he, quickly. What was Houston before he came? They actually have some. They have more history than the Magic. <laughs> oh, <laughs> they no, they do. Didn't. Calvin oh, Murphy, baby. He played with a team, bro. Leader. He played with a team. Okay, shout out to him. <laughs>